Hey guys, on today's video we're going to be updating your iPhone, iPad, if touch to the latest iOS. So it doesn't really matter which one you guys have, it's the exact same process for all of them. So let's just go right into your settings. In your settings, you're going to see your first option where it might say your name or your device's name. Just go right into there and manually make a backup on iCloud. If you guys have no more space on your iCloud, don't worry about it. Hook it up to your computer and make a backup there. If you're on PC, you can use iTunes. If you're on Mac, you can use Finder. I would also like to highlight if you're having any problems with the update itself, you can always update it using your computer. Anyways, once you've done that, just scroll down. You're going to see General. Under General, your second option will say Software Update. And from Software Update, you're going to see Download and Install. Some of you may only see Install at this time without the download. That's because depending on your settings, it could have downloaded the update already and it's ready for you guys to go ahead and install it. Now it is only 143.6 megabytes, it's pretty small. So that's why the downloading process is quite fast and it will be quite fast for most of you unless you have really slow internet. Anyways, let's just tap on download and install. You might ask you for your passcode if you have one, then it's gonna take you here, terms and conditions, just press on agree on the bottom right hand side agree again which is on the right hand side and then it's going to get started with the download process how long will the download process take well again it depends on your internet speed however for the installation and downloading you're not looking at more than 10 minutes for most of you it also does depend which i device you have so this is the first stage just preparing the update which is downloading the update all right so just after a few minutes of downloading maybe five minutes maybe three minutes depending on your Wi-Fi speed, you're just going to tap on install now. So we're just going to tap right there. It's going to verify the update and it's going to turn off. We're going to see an Apple logo and a loading bar. So the first Apple logo and loading bar is going to look something like this and it's going to go a little bit slower than the second one. You're just going to see another black screen for a second or two and then you're going to see a second Apple logo and a loading bar. This one's going to run a lot faster, but this time you should be maybe three to four minutes in. And yes, this is the last step after this. It's just gonna restart and we are all done. And here we go, you're all done. Right now we can just swipe up. You might ask you for your passcode to get in and that's it. That would be it for this update. Right now we're all up to date. But anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.